Hey, it's Scandinavian Bob here with a video for you on how to be fearless in life and become totally badass. <laughs> Seriously though, I'm going to share a few very powerful tips in this video, so stay with me to the end in order to not miss anything. And let me also state that we only want fearlessness when it comes to things that can't actually physically hurt us, so <laughs> use your own judgment. Let me first start with a few important words. It is almost impossible to become 100% fearless, but if it were possible, I don't think we even would want that, because facing our fears and doing something despite that nasty feeling is what courage is all about. A person who does things despite his fear is much more courageous than another person doing the same thing but who does not feel any fear. And also, think about how we grow as a person when we really have to challenge ourselves and then overcome the challenge. That is one of the best feelings we can have. The feeling we get after we have successfully done something that scares us. But hey, I understand. We are all human and negative emotions like fear is something we often would like to avoid or at least feel a little less of. And truth be told, sometimes we have so much fear that we really can't perform well in a certain situation. So with that in mind, let's just jump into the tips, shall we? Tip number one. Take a cold shower. Yes, I mean cold. As cold as can be. Those who haven't tried this simply cannot understand how incredible powerful they are. Especially if you make a habit out of it and do it every day. They are effective at building courage for several reasons. One reason is because they are unpleasant and before we jump in we always feel a little bit fear. By doing it anyway and going through the unpleasant shower, you are literally building up your courage muscles. You see, just like traits like confidence, self-discipline and willpower have to be built up like muscles in the gym, well, so does courage and fearlessness and I seriously can't think of any way more effective to do that than to just saying shut up to that voice in our head telling us No, it's going to be so cold. Don't do it! And you go against that voice with it. This will build your toughness like nothing else. But wait, there are more ways that cold showers help. Cold exposure increases the number of dopamine receptors we have in the brain. Interestingly enough, studies have shown that people who are real go-getters and who are more dominant and who often become leaders of a group, in other words, the alpha males and the alpha women in the world, they have more dopamine receptors than other people. So there's some real biological evidence that cold showers really do make you more fearless. But wait, there's even more because cold showers also increase testosterone levels in our blood. And I think everyone has read and understand how more testosterone might make us more badass. Tip number two. Buy a spiral notebook and write on the first page something like My Courage Builder. And then every day write down a situation that scares you and what you are going to do if you get into that situation. It does not have to be a big thing. Just a small thing is fine because it's the repetition that will make this tip powerful. For example, if you feel shy around a certain girl, you could write something like this. If I see Susan at my work today, I will say, having a good day today Susan? Or is it one of those bad ones? Now it does not matter what Susan replies. What matters is that you did something that your instincts told you not to do and you went against it. And now when you get home you get to write the word DONE in the Courage Builder notebook after the mission you said you should do. And here's the deal. By doing this over and over with new situations every day, you will build up your courage muscles like never before. And not only that, you have it written in paper for your brain to actually see. It's written down that you indeed did what you set out to do. This is very powerful because your subconscious mind will remember that and with time it will start telling you that you got a lot of courage and then you will start seeing yourself as a fearless person that can take on anything. Please start doing this and you will be surprised at the results. Tip number three. Exercise. Studies show that people who exercise have lower levels of fear, worry and anxiety. Again, these are biological effects. It does not really matter what kind of exercise you do, but personally, 
I like strength training because in addition to the biological effects that lowers worry and fear, well, I have to say that walking around with a bit of extra muscles on my body really helps with feeling more secure, confident and well, I guess you could call it fearless. Do something that you like to do. It does not have to be strength training, but you have to do some form of physical exercise. I really recommend that you start doing all of these tips and you will see big improvements in just a couple of weeks or sometimes even just a few days. However, I do know from experience that everyone wants a shortcut. So if you want to cheat a little bit and achieve fast results, then faster solutions do exist. When I want to instantly gain confidence and reduce my anxiety, there is a shortcut I sometimes use. It is something I take when I have to play a trumpet solo in front of a lot of people and it really helps me to nail that performance and be at my very best. Now I don't use it all the time as like I said I prefer using practical tools like the cold shower and the courage builder exercise but hey that's in a perfect world and let's face it sometimes we just have been slacking and being lazy with what we should be doing and when that happens to me then well I do use a shortcut sometimes. If in interested in this then you can read more about it on my blog by writing into your url address bar browser www.naturalhealthevolution.com slash guts and wait a few seconds for it to load it is very powerful so there is no doubt it could help you too but remember i really recommend that you do the practical steps and don't skip them just because there are shortcuts as the practical tools are so valuable to learn to build up your courage and confidence as well there you have it. If you found this video informative, then please press thumbs up, comment something under the video because I would love to hear from you and also consider subscribing. Okay, that's it for today. Have a happy and awesome day.